Hey guys, it's Rory from ANS Gear. We're gonna look at some more bipods today. AIM Sports flipped up or spring tension bipods. These are H style or Harris style bipods. Um, so this particular style bipod is meant to mount to a swivel, which looks very similar to the end, not this threaded part right here, but the end part right here. You'll see these sticking down off the bottoms of uh, long range rifles, sniper rifles. Uh, this, and this is a dedicated H style bipod mount. So if you don't have this little nub with this hole in it sticking off the bottom of your gun, don't buy the H style. Buy a standard Picatinny Weaver style bipod uh, if you have a rail on the bottom of it. If you do have this one, pick up an, a hair style or an H style because it actually lets you move the gun and doesn't keep it rigid, which is easy, it makes it easier to aim and move because you can swivel the gun up and down, left and right, while keeping it on the bipod. It just gives you a little bit more freedom of movement to sight and, uh, and pick up your targets right there. Now, if you are only shooting one thing that isn't moving, it's a static target just off in the distance, then you can use this to a basic bipod. Because this one here, if you're shouldering it and you kind of let it go, it's gonna slop down or move around so it's not really one that you would bolster up. It's one that you need to constantly move around. So um, H style. So on your H style, you're gonna have your bipod, looks like this. Now this particular one has these flip up legs. And I have a medium and a tall one here. The legs are extendable somehow or another. That's locking them down. So if I pull that out, oh, there we go. I undo that, then I should be able to pull this out. And I can kind of control it anywhere in between by turning the wheel and locking it down. So this doesn't have preset spots. A lot of bipods will have click spots where you pull it out a little bit and it clicks, pull it out a little bit and it clicks, and that adjusts the height of the bipod. This has a um, an adjustability that you can set. So besides fully extended, which is what we have here, but anywhere in between, so let me say we want to only go, you know, halfway down on that one. Well, there's no stop spot on it. We just tighten this wheel up and it gets our half spot right there. So if you're using this maybe on uneven ground and you need to have one leg higher than the other, it might come in handy. All right, so let's close those back down. So adjustability on both. And both of them have a wheel on them on this style. So our attachment point is this interesting little, uh, almost looks like a, a collar or a Y right there. It has two little nubs on it. Now these two little nubs are gonna fit in the hole of this adapter piece right here, which will be sticking off the gun. We'll get that to go up inside of here. Let me loosen this up a little bit. More. We just want to get this wide enough so that we can slide this in. There we go. And then you can see it's going to hold on like that. Now this isn't tight. If I wiggle this around, it'll probably fall off of there. But once we tighten this piece down and it pulls this thing down in here, you can see that I've got movement here. So I can move this thing around and still have it a setting up on a bipod. So um, like I said, if you're tracking moving targets or whatever and you need to be able to adjust the gun, then this kind of setup is perfect for you. And it's really easy to take part. It looks more complicated than it really actually is. But once you see it and go, oh, okay, that's how that works. It's very, very simple and actually a little bit more user intuitive or user friendly. Um, so um, definitely check these out. Again, H style, if you don't have this little swivel adapter um, or swivel piece on the bottom of your gun, this will not mount to it directly. Now they do make little conversion pieces which go from like this Harris adapter swivel to a rail. So if you have a rail already, you can get an adapter that attaches to the rail that has this little swivel on it and then you can mount one of these and then you can move it around. There's always a way around it, but if you don't have the rail, you need to have this little thing on the bottom of it and you're ready to go. So uh, H-style bipods, 
Harris style, two different uh, sizes, a medium and a tall, both adjustable. I like the undefined adjustability where you can set it wherever you want it to be. It's not preset kind of cookie cutter, here you go. You can make it any way you want. So check them out on the website, Harris style, H style uh, bipods from AIM Sports. Order yours now through ansgear.com.